Welcome back to my channel. <laughs> hey YouTube, it's been a while. A lot of things have been going on here in my life. I've been super busy with wedding planning, new health diagnoses, moving. It's really chaotic, honestly, and I've wanted to give you guys an update for quite some time now. So today I'm gonna be taking you guys with me as I go about a day in my life and kind of updating you on how I've been, where I'm at. Right now I'm in the car, obviously not moving, on my way to Wegmans to pick up some dietary necessities for the week. So let's go for a ride. For those of you who haven't heard, one of the new things that have come into my life is a medical diagnosis that has kind of taken me by surprise and sort of forced me to have to alter a lot about my lifestyle. I found out through this program that I'm doing called Parsley Health that I have an autoimmune disease called Hashimoto's. For those of you who don't know, Hashimoto's is essentially where your immune system attacks your thyroid gland. So one of the first courses of action, my fiance's mom, who is a health coach and also my own holistic health doctor told me to do, is to go gluten free. I literally went into depression when I learned that I had to change my diet. And that might sound dramatic, but it's the truth. It is the truth. I already have a lactose intolerance, so I cannot consume dairy. So adding the need to avoid gluten just really made my diet feel super restrictive. All right, here we are at Wegmans. I guess that this constitutes as vlogging. I guess I'm a vlogger now. All right, we are back at the car. Did I spend more than I had anticipated? Yes, of course, which is why you should never shop when you're hungry. I got a bunch of protein, turkey burgers, um, sausage. I got some fruits, some veggies, a lot, a lot of veggies. I think it's safe to say it's time to go home. Now I am on my way home to go prep for my For the Field team meeting. Starting this month, I have taken on uh, a few more responsibilities and added a couple more hours towards my position on the marketing team for For the Field, which is a sustainable fashion brand. I really love my team. They're some of the best people I've ever met and it feels like I've known them forever. Money is kind of a stressor for me right now because I'm getting married in September and we are paying for it all out of our own pockets. We do not have any financial assistance. So if you didn't know, weddings get pretty expensive and especially this past month, there have been a lot of expenses of, you know, when it comes to hair trials, makeup trials, uh, booking the rehearsal dinner venue. So much stuff goes into planning a wedding. Um, I think that I'm finally starting to enjoy it though. I don't think that my bank account is. And on top of that, some financial strain comes from the fact that we are working on a house, getting ready to move out, a lot of stuff. It's just a lot of stuff. Another fun part of being me is <laughs> I get mail a lot. I get lots of packages and it is probably my favorite thing. So I'm gonna go in and see if there are any packages. I haven't gotten the mail since Friday. So probably stuff from Saturday, stuff from today. Let's uh, go find out. 15 minutes later. I mean, I live in a small town, but apparently everybody goes to the post office at 11 a.m. Uh, got one package from Hero Cosmetics. <gasps> the Rescue Bomb Mini Post Blemish Recovery Cream. And it looks like there's like a little goodie in here too. What is this? A tiny flower pot. Velvet Queen Sunflower Seeds. So cute. All right, I am home. Everything is unpacked and in the fridge, and I am cooking up some sausage and cauliflower and broccoli 
And now it's time to take my supplements. So the pills are not bad to take really at all. The GI Synergy is a bit tough because there's like a spinachy flavor, but the liquids really suck. Um, it's definitely gotten easier over time, but I still hate them. So I take them with like a flavored drink. Today I have cranberry juice. And for some of these, I actually have to use syringes to suck out the product. I literally feel like a doctor. So five milliliters. All right, I have my very hearty breakfast ready to go. And today I think I'm gonna eat out on my back porch. So another new development is that we are actually in the process of selling my childhood home, which was kind of the plan all along after Josh and I got married, but unfortunately has been sped up because uh, my father lost his job. So I've been doing a lot of cleaning up around here. I've been doing a lot of packing and that is why we brought a whole huge U-Haul of stuff down to Delaware this past weekend because I have to get my stuff out. Um, it has to be relocated. So there's some sadness here, but as beautiful as this home is, there's also like a lot of trauma and negativity associated with my childhood home. And I'm really glad to be moving to a place that's brighter and more positive and doesn't have any of those negative memories associated with it. So here's to change. And now it's 12 o'clock, so it's time for my For the Feel team meeting. And we all live in different parts of America some closer to each other than others. Um, I'm obviously based in New Jersey, Jade is in Delaware, uh, Stephanie's in Virginia, and I think Derek is now in Georgia. Don't quote me on that. So we hop on a Zoom call. All right, two hours later, some For the Field team member connection done. Um, and we're finished with the team meeting. Now I'm just, I guess, walking around <laughs> my yard, but I have a Zoom call with one of my friends from when I was younger, Lindsay. She lives in Michigan now. She has a whole freaking family and a baby. She's married. Um, so we're gonna be catching up a little bit. I'm so excited and I'm getting ready to make some lunch. I'm thinking of doing a turkey burger with a lettuce wrap, some grilled onions, a side of sweet potato fries, homemade, and maybe some cran juice on the side. Who knows? Hi, uh, so it's the next day. <laughs> Apparently, I'm not the best <laughs> vlogger. The rest of the night wasn't that interesting anyway. I made myself um, some chickpea pasta with beef for dinner and called it a night. But I just wanted to give you guys a quick update on how things have been in my life and what's been going on with me. So I hope this was interesting for you. Let me know down in the comments below if you like this type of video style, if you want to see more things like this. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.